Okay, we are recording. Hi, Brenda. I'm so excited to see you today. Yes, I'm excited too. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, so you have recently completed my six week coaching program. Yes, I have. Yes. Which is called the Youthful Skin System. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And um, I would love for you to share, because we're going to be posting this on YouTube. So I would love for you to share um, with our friends on YouTube your experience. Let's start with that, with the six week program. Well, um, or anything, anything you want to say, anything that you think would, that they would find helpful or okay. an another woman would find helpful. Okay. Um, well, to begin with, I'm, I'm a person that is always looking for challenges. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I know that we can always uh, choose to step up or we can be content with what we, what we are. Mm -hmm. And I always like to learn new things about, you know, how to stay healthy, how to stay, how to keep your skin looking nice um, at, at an older age or whatever. Um, mm -hmm. You know, I've been interested in this since I was in my 20s, 30s, you know, and then on. Mm -hmm. um, so um, Chelsea has. Uh, the, the six week program has taken me from where I was to out of my comfort zone mm -hmm. and into some new things mm -hmm. that have only through these six weeks enhanced my life. Mm -hmm. um, it's enhanced my, um, my um, met, um, spiritual life. It has yes. enhanced yes. my diet. Yes. It's enhanced my um, confidence. Mm -hmm. um and, and you also uh, removed that line there. yeah yeah i had a line here that was mm -hmm. just you know very irritating i'm getting older and i'm starting to keep some of those wrinkles on my face mm -hmm. and she showed me how to do a really special nighttime technique that um took away my 11 line right there mm -hmm. and uh, some scrunched uh, where I would hit, hit the pillow just yeah. wrong. I started changing my sleeping habits. She mm -hmm. helped me to do that. And also some tape around here to uh, deter that. So uh, yeah, it was, that's changed my facial um, look a lot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So in one word, phrase, or sentence, how would you describe your relationship with me? Well, I think it's uh, the one word would be something like fabulous, <laughs> because um, I found out that this wasn't just a course. This was a hands-on. Mm -hmm. uh, I will show you. I will work with you. I'll make this personal. And uh, over the course of six weeks, I've also gotten to know Chelsea and, um, you know, we're both somewhat overcomers. And uh, so we're on the same page there mm -hmm. and we've made some good lifestyle choices. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, um, she will help you to do that mm -hmm. and much, much more. Yeah. And it's everything. It's diet, exercise, it's sleeping, skincare. Um, She'll show you what she cooks in her kitchen. I, it's wonderful. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What feedback did you get from your friends and family? Like, because you were doing the program like during Thanksgiving. Yeah. Yeah. And like making the recipes and all of that. So how was that? Like, yeah. Well, I, I have some two daughters-in-law and my daughter and three grand girls. So we were all in the kitchen and we made a pumpkin, um, it's a pumpkin pie mixture. Yeah. That is, you know, you eat it fresh and it's really good and you put nuts on top and everything. And they had a lot of fun, you know, doing that. Yeah. And we yeah. made with bananas instead of the coconut. I, um, I wish we could have done the coconut because that would have been even more fun. But anyway, mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. and it was delicious. Mm -hmm. And they, you know, I said, see, here's your substitute you know, for, uh, you know, pumpkin pie. 
So yeah. Yeah, I love that. What was the best recipe that you made? The best recipe? Well, I, I love the, uh, I always, whenever I'm out of it, I remake the, um, oh, what do you call that? It's um, the creamy cheese sauce. Mm -hmm. That's it. Mm -hmm. And then the, uh, the dressing. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. And I call it my ranch dressing. Mm -hmm. But you no, know, it's just, um, and I've made other things. I've made, um, I've made, uh, my husband, he made the almond butter. Mm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, and this, this time when the girls are out for Christmas, yeah. we're going to try the sushi. Yay. The veggie sushi. Yes. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Like that. So mm -hmm. you're socializing, being with friends, like while mm -hmm. you're getting your mm -hmm. skin of your dreams. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Did mm -hmm. your husband say anything about your skin or about like your attitude or about the six week program? Like as he was watching you kind of go through the weeks, because every week there is a new sort of yeah. program or a new point of focus. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, he was really noticing my uh, change up in eating habits. And mm -hmm. you know, um, um, I don't know that he has really acknowledged a whole lot, you know, mm -hmm. how it's changed me because mm -hmm. I just think he thinks I'm okay <laughs> anyway. Yeah. But, um, mm -hmm. but for me, um, I think that the thing, the nicest thing that he said about it was that I seem to remain calmer mm. in oh, some wow. of the times, you know, that have been coming up because every year it's a stressful time. Yeah. 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 And I've been using my, uh, affirmations and, mm -hmm. you know, quietness and mm -hmm. just mm -hmm. getting peace about myself before I enter into a situation. So mm -hmm. he, did, mm -hmm. he did compliment me on that a lot. So yeah. Yeah. Uh, yay. Thank you, Chelsea. <laughs> yay. I love that so much. Mm -hmm. And basically during the program, we would talk twice a week, right? Mm -hmm. Um, and so what, what did you think about that? Well, I loved it because, I mean, I was wanting to get on with it and, you know, really start working towards things. And on the first day, you would give me something to work on, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. and uh, then you would kind of, on the second day, you would find out what it was that I needed personally. Mm -hmm. And that's, that just is so key because, you know, someone else may need something completely different than me. Mm -hmm. So it's one-on-one -on -one time with Chelsea. Yeah. She does yeah. take time to listen to you mm -hmm. and to figure out, um, for instance, I had, <laughs> I was telling her my neck problems. <laughs> I said, yeah. oh no, I don't want to get older here, you know, and have all these neck problems. Yeah. And, at 65, 70 or beyond. So yeah. wait, what can we do about that? Well, mm -hmm. she showed me all the things that, you know, she, she would have me to do. Mm -hmm. And also went above and beyond that by, you know, giving me other alternatives mm -hmm. and not only just giving them to me, you no, know, she helped me look up a place and I was able to go there and they were able to tell me what they could do, you know, to naturally, Mm -hmm. help my neck mm -hmm. and I just thought wow talk about service this is great you know because mm -hmm. I didn't know I didn't have a clue where to start yeah yeah mm -hmm. yeah so. yeah well I think that's the benefit of working with a coach where this is like their main passion their main interest their vocation their everything in life so it's almost like anything that you wanted to know it's like I had an instant okay this if I don't if I don't know the answer myself I'll refer you to someone who does yeah and yeah. I think that's a huge benefit of dealing with an expert versus someone who hasn't been doing it for that long and they don't really they're more of like a bit of a generalist and um just creates like an ebook, for example, but one-on-one -on -one coaching is so much more intensive and results oriented than an ebook, right? Or like, yeah, or even, even just a course, even just purchasing a course, it's different than working with the person one-on-one, -on -one, isn't it? Right. 
Yes. Yeah. 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 Because I finished many courses and mm -hmm. it, they've never been personalized like this. And mm -hmm. wow, what a difference because you really are actively working mm -hmm. with a coach, you know, for six weeks. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You, you get those things ingrained into your mind to where you can make those changes that you say, I can do this. You yeah. Know? Yeah. And you have the encouragement to do so. I love yeah. it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So basically working with me, would you say it gave you an accelerated result versus if you had done all of this on your own, researching on Google and YouTube? <laughs> oh my, yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. The encouragement and the uh, just knowing that you've been there, done that, that you can't, you know, um, and, mm -hmm. and you're telling me that I can mm -hmm. do this, mm -hmm. you know, well, why don't you, you know, like sleeping on back, you know, mm -hmm. well, why don't you do that? You yeah. know, mm -hmm. when is a good time to start? Yeah. You know? Yeah. Well, exactly. I guess tonight. All right. Yeah. <laughs> I just needed that encouragement along the way. You yeah. know, sometimes when you're doing it on your own, you go, oh, well, nobody knows. Nobody yeah. knows that I read that. Nobody knows. Mm -mm. Yeah. So. Yeah. You're so holding me down. Yes, exactly. Yes. It's the accountability, which is so key, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I'm curious, how, how did you first find me? I think, I feel like we should tell the other ladies how you first found me. Like, on well, time, like through a video or face yoga videos or. Yeah, face yoga videos. Okay. Uh, I was into face yoga a um, long time ago. I, I just very, got very interested in exercising your face and your neck as well as your body. And mm -hmm. so, um, you know, I had, um, actually take another courses even on you know face yoga in itself yeah uh, yeah and um so I thought well you know Chelsea's offering this what oh well then I checked into it and I went wow you know hmm mm -hmm. well you know I need to step up in my diet oh oh yeah she probably has some things for me mm -hmm. and I love to glean from people who know so mm -hmm. that's how I and so I was interested enough and boy I mean, she was there right away. We had our first, you know, talk right away. It was, um, she's been there for me. I'm not a really good texter. And so I don't say a whole lot. Yeah, yeah. I don't yeah, conversate yeah. a lot, but if you do, she's right there for you, mm -hmm. you know? And uh, with any questions and answers right away, oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. I felt like a queen for six mm -hmm. months, six weeks. I wish it was six months. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. And we are continuing to work together. So it'll be longer. Yes, it'll be longer. Yeah. But yeah. And that's that's a separate option as well. If someone desires to even go further in, a, in their goals. And if they're really wanting to maintain that feeling of accountability and connection and support, which is so critical to achieve the long-term results versus doing it on your own. Like we're tribal animals, you know, it's like, well, creatures or beautiful creations, I would say. I would say humans are best in a community of supportive people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And so I love being that support system. And um, in that same way, you have greatly inspired me so much. It was so wonderful to share with you as each week progressed. It was almost like watching a flower blossom because it's there's like a new there's a, a new topic to discuss. There's a new point of focus, yes. and focus is the name of the game. Like focus is everything. Um, in, in something like this, very specialized, because it does require a level of focus and some sacrifice. Like you gave up a lot of, um, well, a few things that you were doing before, like maybe coffee or wine or, right? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. But matcha is really good. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. It's, it's an excellent yeah. replacement. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. The replacements were good. Yeah, yes, yes, exactly. Yeah, so I'll I give you replacements for your like most favorite things. And then did you love the um, that vegan fudge recipe, the two ingredient chocolate fudge recipe? 
Uh, yes, I have some down there right now. <laughs> yeah. For after this. Yes. Yeah. So good, like right? The treat. Yeah, it's a good treat. So mm -hmm. yummy. Mm -hmm. um, okay. So what would you say to someone who is much older than me and said, looks at me and thinks, well, what in the world could Chelsea teach me? She has an experience, like she's not 40, I'm 30, mm -hmm. but I'm not, I haven't experienced some of the signs of aging. What would you say to someone, like I've experienced some, but not, but I'm not like 50, 60, 70. And so for someone who's older and then they look at me and think, what could she possibly teach me? What would you have to say to someone like that? Well, age is just a number to me. So um, at 65, I still have a lot to learn and a lot to grow. So uh, if I were relating to someone else about you, um, it would depend a lot on their, their, atti their attitude. I could speak to probably the younger women easier than some of the older women that say, ah, oh, you just get old. This is just the way that it is they're already made their mind up. They don't want, they, you know, or they want a, a miracle overnight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But what I would say to uh, the, I'll start with the younger is that, you know, you don't wait till you're 40. You don't wait till you're 50 or 60 to begin, you know, um, taking care of yourself. Mm -hmm. You start early and get a good lifestyle going and you keep it going. And then when you're 50, and you're 60, you reflect that, mm -hmm. you know, you get to glow with the health. And I'm not saying that you can't reverse that even at my age, if you wanted to change and, you know, and, and reverse some of that, you can, it's mm -hmm. gonna take work, it's gonna take dedication. It's uh, not an easy, uh, it's not easy to change your lifestyle. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So I would encourage um, younger ones to get on board with the, um, the lifestyle change and keep with it. And then it becomes just something that's easy. You don't even think about it. And those that are my age, why I would encourage them to start today. You know, there's always a new beginning, always a new beginning. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So mm -hmm, mm -hmm. hopefully that was... <laughs> Yeah. Yes, of course. So, so if you were to describe me to your best friend, mm -hmm. what would you say? <laughs> I would say you need to become friends with her too, but I'm her best. You remember that, <laughs> <laughs> but no, I, I would, I would, I would very much encourage them, you know, if they, especially if they saw the results on me, mm -hmm. I would say, well, you know, that is the best way to go. Mm -hmm. um, through Chelsea because she's got the answers. She's going to take you to her cupboard. She's going to take you to your, her bathroom. She's going to show you what she does with her face. She's going to show you what she puts in her body. Mm -hmm. She's going to show you the recipes firsthand. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, mm -hmm. I, I would say, and, and you're going to build a relationship. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, exactly. And um, something else too that I really appreciate is going into the dark crevices of the mind. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because that is where it starts. It's mm -hmm. very interesting. It's kind of like on the surface level, there's these issues of, oh, I drink too much coffee, I drink too much wine, but really what's going on? Is there something going on that has to do with a relationship that's not working anymore or some self-sabotaging behavior? or mm -hmm. some worthiness issue. Mm -hmm. Like it's always something deeper. Mm -hmm. And that's the thing. And so there's something magical about like discovering that and just, I think having that aha moment of, oh wow, mm -hmm. these are my patterns because you know what? So many people go through life and they don't ever go into those dark places in their mind. They don't go into those, those rooms. Because it's almost like, what am I going to find there? It's mm -hmm. too, it's too painful. I'd rather just continue putting band-aids over it because it's easy. Right. And to me, like that is not, that is not a life worth living. To me, I'd rather face it, go for it, like confront my fears. I remember mm 
when um, I first started, um, like juice fasting and whatnot, and that's not for everyone, but when I first started that, I noticed that I had a lot of issues with um, like emotional eating. Mm-hmm. And it was like it, it in for the evening, I would drink it like like a green juice, but I would crave like something warm, comforting, something, even if it's like raw vegan or whatever, like warmed up zucchini noodles with like um, cashew Alfredo sauce, like, you know, but it's, but it's something, it's the concept, it's the idea of hmm, why am I trying to comfort myself with food? Like, this is a problem um, because there's something going on. Yeah. And usually when people put things into their mouth, it's a form of like self-soothing. Um, it's, so it goes very deep, often sometimes to childhood. And well, I mean, doesn't everything go back to childhood? But um, I just think it's really important to reflect on the cause versus just like the symptom, you know? And then once I realized, oh, wow, I'm just wanting to actually connect. I I actually, I was craving that human connection. So then when I started doing this, I would go to yoga every night. Yeah. So, so in that same way, I think, um, I think when someone takes a program like this, I think their stuff is going to come up. And I think it's, there's nothing more courageous or meaningful than like facing that. Yes, mm-hmm. I agree. And some of that stuff has come up and, um, you know, Chelsea's there to hear, but also to, you know, there's genuine healing and being able to share some things. Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, it, it's healed a few things in, that I personally was carrying. And, um, you know, um, you know, the relationship has grown to where we've both shared some and, and it's, it's just really cool how we can encourage and um, help each other to, um, you know, overcome. And that's why I said, it. I think a while ago, we're both overcomers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes, very much yeah. so. Yes. So, okay, so this is like the really fun sentence or the, the fun question. So if you were to describe like in a few words, your life, what your life looks like before the evil skin system coaching program mm-hmm. and after mm-hmm. what would you say is the main difference insofar as your transformation like brenda then brenda now okay well brenda now is more confident mm-hmm. i'm sure i can tackle some of the problems that i thought were so big yeah and um, uh, the affirmations have really helped me because I say them each day, even mm-hmm. though I may not believe exactly, you know, everything they say. But yet, you know, believing that in myself has made me be, has helping me to become that. Um, there's no way that you can't say that the food. Uh, choices uh, don't just stem a whole new person inside because you're making that wise choice to eat something that's going to keep you going and and um, oh and and my sleep my sleep um, it was really rotten when I first began yes it's one of the things I says I want it fixed somehow or just a little bit better mm-hmm. in the last two nights I've had eight hours of good sleep oh my gosh and two nights and wow. you know that's just once in a while every now and again wow that's amazing yeah so I think it's a combination of all the things yeah you know yeah, mm-hmm. yeah that have you know I just I'm putting them together I'm using them I'm utilizing them mm-hmm. and I'm becoming mm-hmm. and that's mm-hmm. why I'm going to continue the program for a while because I I have more questions I have more wow you know um yeah I I continue to I want to continue to grow like I have been yes 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 Mm -hmm. and um the interesting thing is with 
growth, like personal growth and development is that once one problem or once once we achieve, once we solve a prop like one problem, then it's almost like, okay, now this one, now this one, now let's work on this. Now let's work on this. So it's kind of like this evolution of you. Right. Right. It's so cool. And, and like you said, a lot of it goes way back. It just goes back to, you know, how people perceived you as a child, how you were all the things as a child being raised, whatever, and then trying to start out and, you know, be in your job or whatever, yeah. you know, you just have so many obstacles and everything that yeah. trip you up mm -hmm. and just to take a, a point in your life. And that's something else I would tell people that were older is you're never too old to start and yeah. to learn, you know, you're yeah. never too old to do that. So. Yeah. And can you tell our lovely audience how young you are? <laughs> I am 65. Yay. Yay. That's amazing. <laughs> yes. And you're so sexy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. I love that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I just feel like it's so important, like you said, at any age to always just be receptive to new information because sometimes this is very interesting. There's this level of consciousness called unconscious incompetence. Does okay. that so okay. basically where you where someone doesn't know that they don't know? <laughs> yeah. So that, that's like the worst form of ignorance. But then what's after is conscious incompetence which is where they know that they don't know everything, mm. right? Mm -hmm. And so that's, that's where I like to be. I know that I don't know everything. So therefore I'm willing, I'm seeking out information from people who know things I don't know. Yes. Yes. Precisely. Yes. yes. <laughs> to get a certain result, 100% guaranteed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because my program is designed to give you certain results, 100% guaranteed. As long as you follow the system, you're going to get the result. It's like cause and effect. It's really, really simple. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I agree. so, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yay. Um, yeah. I want to ask you too, did you notice any like, like blockages, like mental blockages or any kind of thoughts that you had where you found yourself kind of holding yourself back a little bit like in the program of like oh I shouldn't do that or I don't want to do that or did you just fully like go for it like how was that for you because everyone's a little different well um I'll prelude that with what I did when I was about 35 <laughs> okay there was this um it is a face uh, stretching type thing where yeah. you took your skin and you stretched it right <laughs> and you stretched it both ways and you took a hold of your neck and you and I thought <laughs> well the worst the worst thing that's going to happen to me uh -huh. is that it's all going to just pull out and droop and be horrible looking or it's going to do good like they're saying it will yeah so I went and I did that yeah. all of it you know and I improved. Wow. It improved. It improved. So that gave me the incentive to not be afraid to try new things. Wow. So okay. with you, I was all going, oh, yes, I, I, I paid for the course. Mm -hmm. I knew it was going to be six weeks. Mm -hmm. uh, I kind of picked a, a bad time and I like during all the holidays, yeah. but I thought, why not? That's why I'm not. Doing. Let's do it. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because it's never actually a good time. I mean, like when people say it's like, oh, it's not a good time. It's like, is it ever a good time? It's always someone's birthday. There's all it's like, oh, I just bought a house. I can't afford it. Like, yeah. what would you say to someone who who would say, oh, um, it's probably really expensive. I can't afford it. What would you say to someone who says that? 
Well, it's really expensive and non-affordable to, to pay doctor bills. Yeah, it is, isn't it? And, and, and for yeah. everything, mental health. I mean, yeah. um, those type of things are very, very expensive as well. Yeah. So yeah. Hundreds you, of can, thousands you of put in some money and time into preventing those things yourself. Mm-hmm. Well, then you can, you know, um, actually mm-hmm. save some money, I would think, along the oh, way. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. And um, yeah, I totally agree. Yeah. I do too. <laughs> yes. Because I have saved some. <laughs> yeah. yeah I've, I'm watching people my age, you know, yeah. have, you know, the health issues and so yeah. forth, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I, mm-hmm. I want to help them know that, you know, mm-hmm. um, there's another way. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, well, you could share with them my webinar. And then they book a call with me and then they enroll in my program. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. And I will. Yeah. I will definitely mm-hmm. are yeah. definitely who I would refer them to, of course. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because in Canada, the medical is free or something. I mean, nothing's really ever free, you know, but mm-hmm. in the US it's different. Oh yeah. 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 Uh-huh. Yeah, my um, yeah, my my stepdad had a lot of medical bills, maybe like t- t- ten years ago or something, like hundreds of thousands of dollars. It's unbelievable, and I just thought, wow. And this could all have been prevented because, like, he was life flighted. He was like, he was life flighted to the hospital, like when we lived in Idaho. It was like this whole thing. So, um, yeah, and I just thought, wow, like health. What a what a beautiful thing to have yes yeah yeah mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and it's taken for granted often until mm-hmm. until something happens and it's like oh no mm-hmm. if only i could go back and redo that mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah yeah and many many can't it becomes it becomes worthless if you can't you know be healthy enough to enjoy it yeah right. it becomes right. that we're paying for you know, our doctor bills and our sicknesses more than, yeah, our, our joy in, yeah. in life. Mm-hmm. So yeah, to, to take preventative measures, which this is definitely a course that will help you on taking the preventative measures um, is well worth the money. Yeah. And I would do it again. Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> Yay. Okay. So anything else before we end our call is there anything else you would like to tell our beautiful ladies I guess um I'd like to leave you with to really consider and take a look at what um Chelsea has for you because I really do believe that it has been a um blessing to have her in my life these last six weeks and to encourage me to become the person that really deep down I know I am and can be. She just helps you to, you know, push up out of the dirt and start, you know, getting to where you can bloom and go forward. Mm. So, yeah, I really encourage you to um, try it out. It's worth it. Yay. (laughs) Okay. So, um, ladies, there's a link down below in the description box called Five Steps to Looking Naturally in Six Weeks or Less. You can click on that link and watch my webinar. And at the end of the webinar, there's an option to book a call with me, which is free. And I cannot wait to speak with you. <laughs> okay. Bye. Oh, make sure this YouTube video a big thumbs up. Right, Brenda? We want that. Right. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Okay. Thumbs up. I'm going to end this, and then I'm going to um, call you. I'll do a new Zoom call post, okay? Okay. Okay. All right. Great. Okay.